What's up, everyone? Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to my channel. channel. Today, look at all these damn brushes. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, Jeffrey? <laughs> <laughs> Today, we are about to try the world's most expensive highlighters. Oh my god, girl. <laughs> or the most expensive highlighter brushes. What's or that. Crazy? So today, we're going to try out some crazy ass highlighters. We have the most luxurious brands that we have found around the world who have the highest priced highlighters. And I'm These like, girl. Insane, insane. Now, some of them are illuminating powders, some of them are blinding highlighters, allegedly. Um, so we're just gonna dive in. And of course, we have Laura Lee in the building. <laughs> What's up, guys? The Hillbilly's back. Hi. Yeah. Let me do it. I gotta go love it. Hi. 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 On Laura Lee's channel, we tried out. What did we try out? We tried out the hidden foundation, guys. This is the craziest stuff it's ever. It's some weird shit. Yes. Let's just say that. So. Um, also, I'm gonna just quickly say this: the Manny MUA <laughs> Jeffree Star Cosmetics Bundle Box returns May 13th, Woo! 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Okay, QVC, let's roll. <laughs> okay. All right. Besides that shameless plug, if you want to see us test out some crazy motherfucking highlighters, then keep on watching. All right, so Laura, we're gonna let's just start off with the most expensive one. Uh, that's exactly that's what, what, that's what they're here for. I'm an eyeball on it. All right, so this is the La Mer, the illuminating powder. Now I will say this about La Mer, it is one of my favorite skincare brands. It is one of my favorite foundation formulas. Look at that bottle; so it's good. almost empty already. Now they have some of the most amazing um, products on the market, but this guy, what's the retail for her? Ooh, this is a hundred and thirty dollars. It sure fucking is. That and is good absolutely. lord for one highlighter. But let me be honest; before we even unbox it, it's heavy, bitch. It is heavy. Yes. Yes. So let's see here. There's no instructions. Great. Okay, great. Ew. Okay, so it comes in this gorgeous unit carton. Ooh, it looks something like that. Me. Oh my god, it's in a pouch. Ooh. Whoa. Super okay, hot. so it comes in this beautiful, luxurious, like felt packaging, and the highlighter itself. Whoa! Girl. Wait, open. What? what Girl. Is, I feel something else is in there. Okay, so it looks something oh. like this. It's beautiful packaging. What is that? A brush? A nice little brush. Oh, cute. Yeah. Okay, let's open her up. I've never seen this before. Ooh. <gasps> oh! Oh! Whoa! It's like this crazy. It almost looks like a color corrector. So it has like lavender, orange, and yeah, white, it looks like, like a color corrector little looks. triangles in there. And for this price, I will say this. Of course, La Mer is a bougie ass brand. Yes. You're gonna pay for the name. Everything today, you're paying for the name as well as the formula. Yep. Okay, so this is on the mirror. Little mm -hmm. plastic protector. Great, get off of me, don't touch me. Look, where did it fall? Right in your crotch. <laughs> what does this product even say that it's supposed to do? Right. Usually La Mer comes with a booklet. Where the hell is the booklet? This is a lightweight shimmering pressed powder infused with illuminating gemstones, brilliant pearls, and color true pigments that provide all complexions with a healthy luminous glow. Mm, That's a big okay. statement. Shit. People, like sometimes people read me to fill for like not using the brush that it comes with, but whoever uses the brush yeah. that it comes with? This I is don't. literally a basic ass like Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't like how it would even probably distribute the powder. Right. So we're gonna we have yep. a bunch of highlighter brushes today. Let's just pick up. Yes. This is yours. Uh huh. Here we use the same one. What is this? The Morphe. This is the Morphe five, M510. Five ten. Okay, so we're gonna both dive in here. First of all, let's take the brush. I'm and nervous. Put my let brush me swirl in that. once. Yeah. It's so pretty. It looks a little dull. I'm just gonna it keep it real. It kind of just looks like a little purples on your brush. Okay, so let me just swirl it around. Let's okay. both try it on our right cheekbone. All right. Here, here we go. go. It's it's pretty. I mean, look at that. I'm gonna go ahead and say it's not $130 pretty. Oh, you're already saying that. Okay, I'm just jumping right in. Okay, this she's video. diving in. Let me get a little more. It definitely has luminosity to it. Yeah, for sure, but it's not like that banging highlight that it's you're gonna see. It's not blinding. Like you wouldn't see Now, most of picture. you watching are gonna be like, okay, if it's $130, I better pay my car insurance and I better keep my cheeks Agreed. fucking blinding. Agreed. Layer three, I'm taking it higher to my hairline. Mm -hmm. So if you're a supernatural girl who likes um, the light highlight, you might like this. But. I mean, I don't know about $130 though. Yeah. If you're a bougie ass bitch that likes a subtle glow, and maybe you're on the Royal yeah. Housewives of Beverly Hills, Hills, you might want this. You might want this, but, um, and that okay. sums it up. That's about it, huh? <sighs> Love the compact though. That is like Everything. stunning. It looks so Everything. gorgeous. I almost wish it was bigger too, like. Yeah, like the Dior. Mm -hmm. It's a little small. Yeah. Okay, great. All right, the next highlighter we're about to try out. Well, I've used this one, so I'm not, I mean, it's not really cheating. Laura has never even fucking seen this shit before. Uh -uh. So this is the new Tom Ford Sheer 
Highlighting Duo, and it's in the shade Reflex Gilt, which I love that name. So it comes in this gorgeous compact. So pretty. It's a little more lightweight than see. the La Mer, obviously. Oh yeah, for sure. It feels super lightweight, actually. It does. I wish they would have added a weight to it or something, yeah. but hey. And it looks something Ooh, like this. That looks so pretty. Now, I will say this. I love a metallic. I used this in a tutorial once, and I took it to London a few weeks ago, and I layered it with like five other things, because I have some highlighting problems. I, we so I'm excited to try this by itself. This one retails for how much? That's one is $78. Jesus H. That is 78. crazy. Description, cheek eyes in reflux guilt, a pair of shimmering roses. That's kind of boring. Yeah, let's get to the good part. Else. It's gonna give a light reflecting finish to bronze glowing skin. And okay. versatile cheek and face highlighter. Okay, <laughs> applied wet for a soft, wait what? The shades can be applied wet for a soft veil of color or dry for a sweeping pop. When it's wet, wouldn't it be more intense? I mean, that's how normal things work, but... So okay. why is it saying a soft veil color? That's interesting. Okay, whatever Maybe you say. Maybe cool. Maybe you try it dry. Yeah. And I'll just wet my brush. Perfect. And let's see if they're lying or not. Okay, you dip in first. I kind of want the gold, huh? You, girl. You I'm going to go gold. in. I'm going to get a lot. And line. then do your left cheek. Okay. Oh, yes. What the that ain't, hell? That ain't, that ain't sheer. I'm just gonna say it. Girl, I'm just gonna say it for you. That is super intense. That's beautiful, That's actually. That's stunning. It's so intense. Whoa. You, you dipped in once. once. In the La Mer, I Do dipped I in like four or five times. I'm scared. Okay, I don't we're trying know. it wet. It's we're trying so it wet. pretty. Here we got a little fix plus. Let's dip in Whoa. here. Okay, here we go. Ready? Oh, oh. Yeah, that's pretty intense. Oh, wow. Yeah. How does it look? It looks stunning. It's, oh, it's, it's pretty it's, intense. It's blinding. Let me do a little one more. I swear to God, you guys, on the back of this thing, it says sheer. Girl, I don't know what they're talking about. This ain't and sheer. And Tom Ford does have some sheer products on the market, but this is not one of them. No, and I don't mm -hmm. like sheer, so I'm pleasantly surprised at how blinding this is. You know what's weird is I almost feel like it did apply I do too. more blinding uh -huh. dry. Me too. And I'm too. so shocked. And I've never seen a product do that before. No, it's like less glowy on my, I mean, it's fucking glowing. Yes, for sure. But usually but it's wet. But I felt wet. like, yeah, it more easily applied, more blinding with my dry. It did, wow, okay. weird. Okay, Tom Ford, you're not that bad. <laughs> The next brand that we're gonna try and highlighter is from Burberry. Look at the pan though, girl. Just get ready. Yeah. It's cute, it's cute. Oh! I love that design. It's so cute, it looks like lace. Right, so this is the Fresh Glow Highlighter retailing at $68. I mean, it's Burberry. Girl! It's, yes, it's Burberry. I love Burberry. Actually, I had some of their bronzers and they're fabulous. They're amazing. Yeah, um, they're Yeah, good. I've tried some of their stuff on my channel before. It's very hit or miss, just yeah. like a lot of luxury. I mean, I feel like when a fashion brand makes makeup, it's never like amazing. Yeah. Some good, some bad. So let's talk about this product. Allegedly, this is a lightweight illuminating powder with an intricate lace pattern. Thank you, Laura just said that. So what it does, it is supposed to give you a Burberry glow, a luminous shade, Fuses flattering subtle highlighting with a runway inspired yet effortless strobe. Your complexion is illuminated and your features are defined by sweeping the pearly, translucent powder across the areas of your face where light would naturally These hit. descriptions are the most They're the dramatic. They're most. fucking dramatic. Okay. So it says apply it around the edges of the face. Oh wow. Temple, center, cheeks, nose, anything you want, Cupid's bow. It also can be applied to your eyes, decolletage, and uh, and your arms for a flattering glow. How cool. All right. Should we do our ear like Bretman? Yeah. <laughs> I kind of want to. Yeah, Bretman yeah. does the whole fucking earlobe. That's live, really cool. I kind of live for yeah. it. It's sickening. Okay, cool. Shout out to you, boo-boo. Okay, so. I don't want everyone to Oh, wait, I'm this ear. I'm going to put it on top of this cheek because this one is pitiful yeah. over here. So you guys, where the La Mer was, she's getting covered. Yes. Um Okay, cool. I have another clean highlighting brush. I have brush. the Y14 from Morphe. Ooh, I already ruined the, oh, that's a lot of fucking pigment. Whoa, so you go in light handed. <laughs> Shit. Oh my God. All right, let's roll. Ooh, I'm excited about this one. Okay. I mean like you can literally oh. just see this like melt onto my oh skin. Oh my God, it's melting. It really is. Wow, look at that. Whoa. It's like a fucking mirror. Barbara, I'm dipping in again. Lay, honey. Fuck me. I, I really like the color of this too. Makes your skin it's just like a, like wet. Yes, it's like, like a champagne pearly like pink. Ooh. So pretty. And this is in shade Pink Pearl. All oh, right, there well there you go. <laughs> Are we doing our said, ear? Yeah, I'm gonna do my ear. Why is this so pretty? I would have thought to do the ear. Thank you, Bremen. Right, come on. It says Hawaiian secrets. All, the, all those island secrets. Mm -hmm. Okay, wow. Burberry, I mean $68, I don't even care because uh, I'm in love I with love it. I love it. If you want a blinding, all blinding right. highlight. And there's like four more shades. So wow. there's probably one for everyone. Okay, wow. I'm, I love it. I'm really impressed. I'm all about it. Okay. Woo! 
Next one. Woo! I'm like not over this. Oh my god, I know! What can beat it? Let's try it. Alright, what's next? I like the whole body with that. Okay, next is the Dior Skin Nude Air Luminizer. This is 001. Okay, there's four shades. And yep. this is a whopping $56. Ooh, the Girl, pan's pretty. It looks, it looks blinding in the pan. Pretty. It sure does. Now, this is a highlighting powder with a highly concentrated formula with illuminating pigments. So it's gonna give you an, oh. So this says, with its virtually imperceptible texture, texture. Dior Skin the drama. reveals glowing skin for a radiantly luminous complexion. It all says the same shit, it's supposed to glow. <laughs> okay, fuck. Where should we put this? Okay, I'm, gonna put it, I'm gonna put it right here, huh? Ooh, Don't like you on think? the collarbones? Yeah. yeah, okay. And then you do your nose and Cupid's bow. Amazing. The All thing. right, um, feels about the same, huh? Like yeah, the it does. Powderiness. Now the compact looks metal, but it is a plastic, so it's not as oh, heavy yeah. as the La Mer one. It has a little magnet closing, which I love. Okay, cool. Let's try the nose and cheeks. Let's see. I want to see you for. Oh. Oh yeah, that's pretty. Holy I want fucking more. collarbones. Give me hmm. more. Work. I'm gonna put it right over my fucking lip gloss, ready for this? Yeah, that's pretty. Uh huh. I would say the Burberry's more intense. Okay, let me try some where they can actually see. Let me do the tip of my nose. I think the Burberry one is a little more more blinding. Yeah. But this for is sure. really pretty for someone that likes to be glowy, but not like oh my god, oh my god like, screaming in your face yes, glow. Yes, I think this is perfect. Not obsessed, but I do love it. I love Dior. It's one of my favorite beauty brands as well as fashion. This is really pretty though. I would probably wet the brush for this one and just go. See ham. now that. Yeah, that's the one you want to wet the brush on for sure, right? Well, I'm gonna try it. Yep, that's right. Okay, let's try it. Okay, here we go with the wetness. Sometimes the powder gets weird. Oh, Ooh. okay. No, I think this one's gonna be like super intense. See that thing that's gonna brush? Oh, yeah. Oh my god, look at the middle. Oh! <gasps> look at look her bow. Like <gasps> oh my god, that did it! It's I like love intense. it. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> okay, we have, we have one more to try. Yep. Let's give her a whirl. And the last highlighter that we're going to try today is Whoa. from Becca. Now, this is the new Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed Prismatic Amethyst. Now, the box is really like holosexual. I am living for that. So cool. Hopefully, the powder looks the same or I'm going to scream. <laughs> so, this is a lavender duochrome highlighter is what the website says. That's how you unbox her. Mm. Now, this says, like a spotlight for your skin, this will light up your favorite features with a high-impact Ultra reflective shine. That's a bold statement. It says inspired by the dazzling light of the midday sun This iconic formula is enriched with ultra fine luminescent pearls that absorb reflect and reflect light to amplify your natural radiance It better change my life. Okay. So here oh. she is. She kind of looks like lavender a little white too. It looks really pale. Okay, cute Yeah, it looks Her. a little pale, huh? Okay. Okay. Oh wow. That is that has Ooh. some fallout bitch. Just Major. Some fall like out. All right. Duo. I mean, okay. It looks kind of duo chrome. I mean, I guess let's. Where am I gonna um, put mine? Looks, yeah, very iridescent. <gasps> That's a lot of powder. Yeah, look at that. Come on, Fallout City. All right. Okay. So um, yeah, what are you gonna do? Uh, I might do my lids and like I'm kind of yeah. running out of room. Me too. Okay, let's, let me see you first. Go ahead. Oh. It looks like white powder, honestly. Kinda. It's a little chalky. It looks like chalky. It has a little bit of pearlescence, but I wouldn't say duochrome. I think no. that's kind of like. Mm -mm. Okay, let me try it on my eyelid. Ready for this? This is okay. the most. I mean, I don't have anywhere to put it, you guys. Let me try it right <laughs> here. I'm reaching. Oh wow, it's a lot of like shit. Okay, I'm gonna try my <laughs> collarbone because mm -hmm. I don't think my lid is a fair statement. We'll put it, we'll put it right over grandma's Elvis. cheek. Right over grandma. Okay, ready for this one? What does it look like? Kind of cool. It kind of looks like iridescent, not super strong. Um, I don't really see it on the monitor. How is it in person though? Like, look. Let me know. Let me look. It looks a little powdery. Just being dead honest, like you could see flecks of like actual powder. It's not like melting into your skin. If you get what I'm saying, like can you see like. Oh wow. You look like you're dry almost. Oh great. <laughs> um. Um, I'm not feeling this, Jeffrey. I don't, it's not duochrome to no, me. No, like, I don't. This looks like white powder on me. Okay. In maybe, my opinion, uh, maybe pink powder. I don't know. It looks like powder I'm not, not a highlighter. I'm not, I'm not living for this. No. I love the. You know, I love Becca. I love the packaging. Totally. I've lived for their Agreed. highlighters for a long time. Agreed. Um, Completely. And it, it's barely shifting. I wouldn't say duochrome. That's a reach right there. We are reaging. <laughs> um, okay. I, uh, all right. Let's do our final thoughts. Oh, uh, listen, we had five crazy moments here. I'm gonna say it for us. Burberry is the win. Yes, easily, easily. It was the win. Now the two that were like mediocre. Yes. So these ones weren't horrible. Yeah. But they weren't the best on earth. But they were pretty good. Yeah. I mean they were. They I were, like them. They were blinding. Mm -hmm. They were cool. This one though, sheer my ass. No. Okay? The there description no is completely wrong on that friend. It, it was, but it was the first highlighter that I've ever used wet that was less, less blind. Yeah, less pigmented than the, than the dry. Yeah, I agree. Which is weird. 
Um, now the ones that fell a little flat, I mean, La Mer, I fucking live for you, but $130 Girl, that for price, this? that price, you got a lot to own up to at that price, and it just didn't do it for me. It didn't do it for me at all. So, mm -hmm. this one, sadly, love the packaging, formula, mm, mm. <laughs> <laughs> And then we had the Beckham Prism Prismatic, and I just felt like, especially for my skin tone, it looked like pink powder on my face. It, yes, I'm not living for it. My mm -hmm. collarbone kind of flopped. I live for the unit carton. Like yeah. I love the packaging. I mean, the packaging suck. But the powder was not living for it. No. I feel like the other formulas are more creamy. Yeah, and that was um, very like, like opal loose and moonstone powder. is like yeah for sure. Like butter for sure. So I don't know what happened here. Not living for it, but I can't wait to see what they put out next. Yes. But um, yeah. So Burberry won, you guys. Yay! <laughs> now the beauty world keeps putting out so many crazy highlighters. Like I feel like every few weeks there's like something coming up. Agreed. So those are the most expensive ones that I could find for this uh, time frame, and I'm sure there'll be a lot more coming. So yep. if you guys like us testing highlighters, sound off down below. And what else? I think that's it. That's guys. it, bitch. So if you guys want to, and you know you don't have to, don't do it. Subscribe to Laura Lee's channel. <laughs> Um, check out Laura's channel. We have a video over there where yep. we tried this crazy hidden foundation that we found on Sephora. Yes. So go on there. Yes. And we're wearing the foundation right now. We sure are. We're so doing a wear a test. Sneak peek. It's kind of sickening. Yes. I don't know, but did it get approved? Y'all have to watch right yep. there. Yeah, watch to find out. But um, all right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know which highlighter you loved in the comment section down below, and we'll see you on the next one. Mwah. Bye, guys. Bye. Hey everyone, hey everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to my, my channel. channel. Slow it down. God damn it. Okay, let's try again. Hey everyone, <laughs> welcome back. You, you put a comment in there. Welcome yeah, right on. back. What, I always say, what's up everyone? That's what's, what's up, up everyone? everyone? Welcome, welcome back to, to my, my channel. channel. Okay, cool. That's what you do. Ready? Good. This is not a mirror. <laughs> what's, what's up, up everybody? everybody? Why do I say everyone and everybody? What's up, everyone? Two, three. What's, What's up, up, everyone? everyone? Welcome. Welcome. We just we yeah, need, we need did. Way we more did energy. so bad. We did so. I'm just gonna drink the blood of my enemies. <laughs> what well, should we get? Four glasses. <laughs> What's? Oh, <laughs> Jeffrey.